Vanderpump Rules is back and it's kicking off with Lala Kent having some second thoughts about sending it to Daryl. What I can relate to is feeling isolated and feeling like the person who has made you feel like they're the only one, but if you go against them, them, you have nothing. So much so that she decided to send it to Rachel. Hey Raquel, um, I'm sure I'm like the last person you expected to hear from. Um, I hope that you're doing okay. I mean, there is no greater anxiety than seeing seen in a DM, but especially when it's sent to someone that you're like actively feuding with. Hope to talk to you soon. Oh my God, she saw it. I feel like I'm gonna throw up my pants at the same time. Rachel wasn't the only person Lala was letting her feelings known about. She also chatted with Ariana a bit. Really? I can't tell if, if you like, like me or if you tolerate me at times. I like you. What? And after that chat, she quickly told Ariana about said DM, which Ariana didn't really love. I am feeling like, but I don't want her to wear this for the rest of her life. But I think we can all at least be happy that Lala's DM to Raquel was a little bit nicer than Ariana's text to Schwartz. I don't remember exactly what I said to Schwartz, but I don't think it was that bad. It says you, blocking your number, go choke on Sandoval's dirty ass somewhere. <laughs> Jesus. For the record, I've never choked on Sandoval's dirty ass. 